how to create PayPal account in Ghana. Okay, so as you can see, this is my PayPal balance. And in this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to also create a PayPal just like this. From your phone, simply go to Play Store and then come and then select it. Okay, and come here to the search icon and then click on it and come and search for paper okay paper so when it comes simply come and then select this paper and as you can see to tell you that if you are looking for paper sorry it is not available in your region or country yes it is because paper is not allowed to be created in ghana don't worry i'm going to show you a way out okay so over here simply locate the settings on your phone and then come and then select it and then simply scroll down here to where we have the app management and then come and then click on it and come here to the app settings and then select it okay come and then search for play store okay so simply come here where we have the google play store come and then select it then come here to where we have the storage and then catches and then come and then click on it so when you click on it simply come down here to where we have the clear storage where we have the clear cache simply come and then click on it and then click here to where it says clear storage and then come and then click on it and it's going to ask you do you want to clear the data yes we want to clear it simply come and then click on ok ok so we have successfully clear our play store catches simply come here again then come and then click on play store and you will see that it is a brand new play store come to the search button then click on it and then come and then search for proton vpn okay and then come and select this one so come and select the official proton vpn just like this one and then click on it so when you click on it you will see that it is right here it is totally free come and then click on the install button okay so it is going to download and then when it's finished downloading it is going to install so as you can see it has finished installing simply come here to where we have the open come and click on the open button okay and then proton vpn is going to be opened you can continue as a guest but since we are going to be using the paper for a lifetime, simply come here to the sign button and then come and click on it. Okay, so let's click on the sign in. So when you click on the sign in, you are going to be asked to put in your email address and then your password. If you haven't created an account already, let me show you how to create an account on the Proton VPN. Simply locate the Chrome icon and then go to this Google and then come and then search for Proton VPN. Okay. When it comes, simply come and then select the Proton VPN, just like this one, the official site, and then come to the website and then scroll down. Okay. You will see that we have free VPN. That is the free version of Proton VPN. Come and then select it. So over here, you can use the free version of the Proton VPN, but it comes with limitations. You only can use it for these purposes, okay? And then simply come here to where it says get Proton VPN free, and then come and click on it. So over here, come here to where it says continue with free, and then come and click on it yes so all that you have to do is simply come and then create an account by coming to put in your email address right here so after putting your email address simply come down here to where we have start using proton vpn and then come and click on it so after clicking on it your account is going to be created for you okay so as you can see we have created our account now we have to create a password you can copy this password if you want it by simply coming here okay and then come and click on this it is going to be copied for you and you can use it but i want to create my own so simply come here to choose my own password select it and then come and put in your own strong password here okay after that come and then confirm the password and after confirming it all that you have to do is simply come here and then come and click on set new password and you will see that i have been able to create my account okay for proton vpn it is asking me to download the app so close it because we have already downloaded it simply come here to the play store and then come in and open the app and now come and put in your email address here come and put in the password that you set here and then simply scroll down and then come here to where we have the sign in and come and click on the sign in now as you can see we have successfully log in but you can see that it says that you are not protected it is still using the Ghanaian vpn okay so 
We are in Ghana, so we have to come here to where it says connect and then connect it so that we'll be connected to another LANs VPN. Okay, so you just click on it and it is going to ask you and then come and click on OK. Yes, so as you can see, we are now protected and then we are connected to a Netherlands VPN. Great. Now, all that you have to do is to simply come here to Play Store again, come and then click on the Play Store, and now we are now using a Netherlands Play Store. Simply come here to the search icon and then come and click on it, and then come and search for paper. You will see that the paper is here. Come and then select this paper and then click on Install. So now it is going to download the paper for us and then after that it's going to install it so as you can see it is installing it great so after it's finished installing simply come here and then come and click on the open button okay so now we have successfully installed our paper and then we can simply create the account using the paper app okay so as you can see we have it here we can then come here to where we have the sign up and then come and click on the sign up great now they are going to ask you this don't worry simply make sure that you close it okay so simply come in and then come and click on the close button and then come here to the location click on the down arrow and you will know that we are connected to the netherlands vpn or Netherlands IP address that is great okay so now all that you have to do is simply come in and put in your personal email address here the one that you want to use as your PayPal account okay come and put it right here and then come here and then come and click on the next button okay the next thing I have to do is simply come in and then put in a Netherlands phone number when you click on the down arrow you will know that Ghana is not included here okay so you have to put in a Netherlands phone number but there is a problem here even if you use a virtual phone number and then you come here and then you come and click on the next paper will never send you the code no matter what you do paper will never send you the code don't worry all that you have to do is that you have to close it okay and then go to google and then go and search for paper Netherlands okay just like this one paper Netherlands and then come and then select it and then over here it will bring you right here to the paper but it is not in english it is in dutch come and click on the translate button so that it will translate it for you into english okay so now so now that it has translated it simply come and then click on sign up for free and then over here come and then choose a business account after choosing a business account come here to where we have the continue and then come and click on the continue okay so all that you have to do is that come to the three dots and then come and click on it and come down here to where we have the translate and come and click on the translate you have to do this on each page that you are so that it will translate it to english for you because it is not in english okay so we can now open our account come and then put in your first name here your surname and then come and choose your Ghanaian number by clicking on the down arrow okay and then come and scroll through you will see that Ghana is here okay take your time scroll through and then you're going to see Ghana is here come and then click on it and select it come and put in your email address here come and then set a strong password okay make sure that all this check marks is checked and then come and then agree to their terms of service and make sure that this check mark is checked and come and check for this box as well okay and then after filling everything simply come in and then come and click on agree and open account so over here you will see that we have successfully created the account they are going to send us a confirmation code on the Ghanaian number that we put here okay so this is my Ghanaian number come and then click on receive a code by sms and then over here they have sent us the code let me put it right here and then simply come down here to where we have the save and then come and click on the save great so we have successfully created our paper business account it's totally free okay so now what you have to do is that you have to come here as i said to the three dots click on it and then come and click on the translate button and you have to do this each time you go to the next page okay now we have to activate our business account okay so as you can see 
we have to activate our PayPal account. Simply come here. Okay, you have to do it because if you do it, it is going to help you to receive money into your PayPal account. Okay, so simply come here to where it, it says, let's get started and then come and click on it. And then over here, you have to come and then choose or describe your business. Come here and then select private seller. Okay, click on it. After selecting a private seller, what you have to do is simply come down here to where we, we have the let's get started and then come and click on it. Okay, and then over here, come and then make sure that the name that you entered, it is the exact name on your Ghana card. Okay, you are going to use your Ghana card to verify your PayPal account. Okay, so simply come and then make sure that the first name and then the same name is the exact same thing. And then come and set your date of birth. Make sure that it is the exact same date of birth on your Ghana card. And then the nationality, come and click on the down arrow and then come and select Ghana. Okay. So after selecting Ghana, all that you have to do is simply come and then put in your address right here. Okay. In the address line one. But make sure that you don't put in a PO box. It will not be accepted. Simply put in, let's say, if you are in Kumasi, just say Kumasi Ghana. Okay. Put it in the address line one. Okay. So just put it right here. And then after that, simply come and then put in your postal code. You can use 00233 as the postal code right here. Okay. Or you can go to Google and then search for some and then come and post it right here. Then come and select the place. Okay. And then after that, what that you have to do is simply come here to where it says PayPal payout settings and then come and select that one. Okay. So the next thing I have to do is to describe your organization. Okay. So simply come here and then where it says the name of your company, come and then put in the name that you prefer. I'm going to call my T books. Okay. That is the name of my company. Okay. And then make sure that you come and then change the euro okay that is the currency to a dollar okay by simply coming here to where we have the us dollar come and then select that one okay so after selecting it it will come just like this the primary value is now us dollar okay and then after that simply fill the next thing and then come and select what you are doing okay so and then this is your monthly Estimate simply come and then click on the down arrow and then select the first option. Okay, so the first amount starts from zero dollars to ten thousand. Just select that amount, and then over here they are going to ask you, Do you have a website for your company? If you don't have some, simply come here to the now and then come and then check the circle, which means you don't have any website for your company. Okay, and then after that, simply come here and then come and put in your address, but you can check the box. And then they are going to use your home address with your business address as well. Okay, just like this one. And when you are done, simply come down here and then come and click on PayPal Payout Settings. Okay, so after clicking on it, you will see that we are all done. We have successfully created our PayPal account. We have to verify our email for them to know that it is our email that we have used to create the account. So let's go to our phone and then let's go to the mail app and then come and select the email. Okay. So they have sent us the email. So they are saying that we have to click on getting started in order to verify our email. Okay, so let's click on the button below. So let's click on getting started. And we have successfully been logged in into our PayPal and then we have created it without any limitations. Okay, so with this paper, you can use it to receive and then send money and you don't have any limitations as well. Okay, so what you have to do now is that you have to go to the paper app and then log in directly to the paper app so that you don't get any problems. Okay, like the video and then see you in my next video.